I started here, the nine uh, was already happening as a weekly choir ensemble for people to be a part of. Uh, but it, it wasn't until a student at the time, Lisa Shroka, who's now married, Lisa Taus, uh, she, as part of a class that she was taking uh, through the Catholic Studies minor, came up with this idea that with student leadership, the nine could become uh, reinvigorated and incorporate more students, incorporate more student leadership. So with her, uh, you know, the hard work and organizational skills, uh, that's when the nine, as we know it today, was founded. So, so it was with her leadership that the nine uh, became reinvigorated, and then since her time, we've we've carried that structure of leadership um, year after year, changing and developing. Uh, and so that's that was the heart of it was through uh, a student's um, desire. And then... My most memorable experience at the nine. Um was right after my first music ministry retreat. Uh, back when I was a first year student, it was the first week of the semester, so Steve had worked really hard to recruit a lot of students. It was my first encounter with community here at Loyola, um, and it was absolutely co incredible. Uh, the whole retreat was a transformative experience for me. It felt like I finally entered into a space um, where uh, I no longer was just like having light conversation with students in the dining hall. I was really encountering people one-on-one -on, -one, um, on this retreat setting. And then the particular memory that I want to describe was our trip home. We all got on the bus and the two Jesuit chaplains that were with us, Steve Nicholson and Eric Immel, they pulled out their instruments and we continued all of the music that we'd been rehearsing on retreat right there on the school bus. The driver was jamming with us. We even did some Disney favorites, um, but it really did bring home for me this experience of community and music and joy. Um, and it's something that I've carried with me ever since. Um, I think the night is so unique because there's not, no one's holding you to the commitment of coming every week. Um, you don't have to, you can come as you please and come once and never again. Um, but I think it's beautiful that with that said, still there's this huge group of people that's committed to coming every week. Um, and that makes a point to do that and that's their, I don't know, a piece of their week and kind of their like Sunday ritual is going and singing or playing with the nine. I really like a place at the table. That was like, I think that was the first song we sang at Mass of the Holy Spirit my freshman year. And um, yeah, it was before I really, I mean like, I knew a little bit about the Jesuits and like the social justice aspect of Jesuit education, but I feel like that song like really spoke to me. Um, and it kind of, it also made me like feel welcome, I guess, because like I knew that I had a place at the table in this community. In regards to mission, uh, the heart of what we do is praise and prayer, um, but then I'm thinking of, of specific kind of ideas of Loyola's Ignatian um, heritage, finding God in all things. We take any person uh, and any ability, any amount of time that they can give and we utilize all of their talents. So uh, we were talking earlier today in a meeting that if a person comes on the last Sunday of the last semester of their senior year, we will take them for that Sunday. If they come um, for Mass of the Holy Spirit before freshman year starts and sings with us for all four years every single Sunday, we'll take them there too. If they um, are a music major or just interested in singing, uh, we'll take anyone wherever they're at. So, um, taking that step and walking into rehearsal is probably the hardest part you can do. So um, you're seeing me on this video, you can come and say it's my first time. Uh, any of our student leaders and uh, everyone in the group, we've all talked about being welcoming to new people. So everyone that's there uh, is happy to welcome you. So I'd say the hardest thing is, is walking out the door and hopefully the easiest thing you do is seeing them.